I'm Brayden with Drone Spray Pro, and today we are lifting a gearbox with the DJI T100 lift kit. And you can see we've got it on the scale. It's covered in mud, it's got some water in it. It's a real life scenario happening here. Weighs 125 pounds. Um, so we will be lifting that with the double lift kit, and that has a rating of 176 pounds. There's also the single lift kit with 220 pound capacity. But what they don't tell you is it may be less than that. And the reason why is because your density altitude. So where you're at, your elevation, that's going to diminish some of the weight that you're able to carry. Um, so what we've done is we've created a page on our website that you can type in your zip code and it will bring up your elevation and it will tell you based on if you chose the single or the double lift kit, what your true payload capacity is going to be the connectivity between a smartphone and the remote controller. And so I'm gonna show you how that setup starts. Once you're connected to your T100, you're gonna go into your settings here and go over to your lift. And once we get to the lift here, we're gonna hit invite to join. And this is going to create a QR code. And we're gonna go into our DJI Smart Farm app. We're gonna to go to field. And up here, we're gonna see a little hook. And then we're going to scan that QR code. Now you can see it has got everything linked and this remote controller is going to be using the GPS reference on this phone. So now that Nate is out in the field, he has opened his DJI Smart Farm app and he has dropped a mark for us. Uh, we can see that on the controller live and we can use that as a reference point to automatically have the T100 route his direction. Okay, now that we can see Nate, a good view on the ground here and I'm excited to try this. Um, this is something I've been looking really forward to on this double lift kit is this discard cable function. Um, it's just a warning just saying to make sure that it's straight and the area below is safe. So we're going to go ahead and move this to the right. Okay and it's saying it's cutting the cable which um, really uh, it's, it's heating up that anchor point and it looks like it's just gonna keep heating that up until we notice that it has been dropped. So I do think that is a really, really cool feature. Um, <laughs> I mean, you can see that burned through that guide pretty quick. 